Are you still using Black Pro Mist on everything just because it makes it less digital? Yeah, me too. But I have been digging way deeper into this lately, and here is what I've learned. There is mist filters, there is dimple diffusion filters, and there is C diffusion filters. The mist filters, like this Black Pro Mist, use suspended particles in the glass, and that's what causes the real bloom and highlation of the image. And there's the dimple diffusion filter, like this Hollywood Black Magic. The dimples on the glass are just like tiny optical bumps and they blanket a soft blurred layer over the sharp image. Instead you get fuzzy edges instead of that dreamy spread out halation. And this one is my favorite. It's the C-shaped diffusion, like the Tiffin Black Magic satin. Instead of adding extra halation, these C patterns soften detail without throwing extra halation around the lights. The actual glow only comes from the mist particles and not the diffusion itself, so it's not doubled. Same look, more control. And I want to give a huge thanks to David Mullen, ASC. His technical breakdowns of how these filters work is really what made me connect the dots. So, what's the bottom line? Your Pro Mist might feel safe, but understanding why and how it works really helps with expanding your vision and your creativity. More creative control, in other words. In part two, we will go deeper into what makes the black in Black Pro Mist, what the different mists actually do. Also, drop a comment if you have any particular filters that you want to see, because I am preparing a side-by-side, -side, and uh, let me know what favorites you want me to compare.